Hi, this is Magical Marlena, and today's video, we are going to be talking a little bit about your houseology, the home and body connection. I'm using the word um, houseology uh, because I want to bring you into um, the knowledge of your home, like astrology. It works with your planets and your you know, birth date and year, all right? So it gives you a sign. Your house also <laughs> has a sign, all right? It had a date of birth, all right? Just like you and I. It was born on a certain year, on a certain day, right? In a certain place, right? On a certain piece of land, or it was moved there, you know, such as a trailer, or you're, you had your house moved somewhere, and that's fine. But your house has a signature. It actually has an energy to it, a vibration, all right? So the body and the home are much connected. When you go down the street, you notice different homes and your eyes are drawn to a certain type of house um, in a certain area, right? Some people like homes that are in the um, hills, um, you know, some like them um, in the woods and other people like them in the city. And then people like me would like it near the water somewhere. So we're all drawn to an energy, number one. And number two, our mind is used to a certain thing. It doesn't like much change, all right? It doesn't want to come out of the box, so to speak. So then comes the body. Your body will not be comfortable in a place, okay, that does not resonate with it. So your houseology and your body must be connected, okay, for you to feel comfortable in your space or in someone else's space, okay? And um, this is what we're gonna do right now. On the screen, I have posted two different types of homes, all right? Which one um, were you uh, brought up in? Which type of home? The one on the left, which is organized and clean, or the one on the right, which is disorganized and everything is all over the place and cluttered, all right? So which home is your mind used to? Okay, and if you choose the one on the right, which is disorganized, okay, that's what energy your mind is used to. Your body does not like that energy, believe me. So it is in cahoots with it 24-7. So if you grew up and you thought, this is how it is. We have a bunch of stuff. We keep adding on and on and on. We have nowhere to put it. Um, you will notice that you have stagnation in your life. Your mind is confused. You can't concentrate. You don't have much motivation. When you walk by rooms that look like that in your home, your vibration goes down. You know, you look at it and go, ugh. And that's the truth, all right? And if you walk in someone else's space and it looks like that, your vibration goes down, okay? Um, your finances dwindle, right? Your health goes down. Your relationships suffer, right? There's usually chaos. Um, kids have trouble studying or adults, you know, trying to learn. Um, the energy just keeps bouncing off all this stuff, right? So that's some of the signs of that. And then on the left, have a home that's almost um, 
feng shui um, properly, uh, but we're going to use it for today's example. As you see, each and every room is clean, clutter-free, right? Organized, neat, all right? So what happens in that kind of home? The energy flows through freely. People are comfortable. They're peaceful. They're relaxed. They feel good. Their finances are flowing, okay? The relationships are good because everything's in balance and harmony, all right? And if you grew up in the other kind of home and you go into that home and you were invited there to stay over, you feel very uncomfortable, right? Because you're afraid to move something or mess something up, you know what I mean? And if they come from that organized home and come into yours and see that clutter and stuff, they're like, ew, you know? So this is what I'm talking about, not picking on anybody. I'm just letting you know that your mind and your body are very much connected to your home space. All right, that's number one that we're going to be talking about um, today. All right, so um, I was invited to go speak um, on the Awakening Heart Network uh, Thursday, all right, June 24th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, USA. I'm going to put that information, the phone uh, link to call right in. Um, raise your hand by pressing star 2 and ask questions because we're going to talk about all kinds of issues. So if you're having financial issues in your home, um, health issues, very important, especially now, um, what you can do to remedy some of this stuff, um, it's not always clutter, all right? It's not always clutter. There's other things happening. But if you've been to healers and had clearings and, you know, tried acupuncture and chiropractic and you tried to, you know, um, invest money, save money, sell things, all this stuff, right? You tried being loving and, you know, compassionate and your relationships just fell apart and it's a pattern. This is a call for you, all right? Also, if you have uh, dark energies, entities, ghosts, you know, things missing in your home, you know, this is a call for you. It's a call for everybody just to give you, you know, some more information. You might be someone who follows feng shui and you use all these, you know, um, yearly cures and things like that. And, um, you know, that's wonderful. I also have easy um, remedies that, you know, help quickly. Um, and I'm going to share some of the things on the call and offer my brand new package that I just put together um, for this uh, houseology um, coming to you to bring you clarity and hope and balance and peace, prosperity, love, and better overall health. Now, we know we've just had the COVID, and a lot of people are very stressed out. So, spending, you know, a lot of time in our homes now, our houses, all right, have this energy, this vibration, the emotions, all right, left behind from old occupants or from us, you know, depending on, you know, if you were the first owner, right? Um, or if you have uh, been moving into apartments, you might live in a hotel room right now. You might live in your car. Um, my clients are in all kinds of conditions, so they don't stay in those, you know, lower conditions working with me. Um, I've seen people come out of their car and they own a home now. And, you know, it was within a short period of time. So if you're really serious about, um, you know, bettering your life, right, in one area or all of them, then hop on this call and engage with us. Ask questions, um, you know, listen in, assist other people, you know, by your question, right? 
or by sharing a testimonial from working with me. I know that life has been hard for a lot of people. It wasn't easy for me. Like I said, I grew up in a house with like the one on the right, okay? And every time we've moved, which was a lot, okay, um, they would take me and place me in the new place, the new apartment, and say, straighten up the furniture. So they would dump a bunch of stuff off, and I would rearrange the house and set it all up, all right? And then I noticed what was going on. They were leaving some of my stuff at the old place, right? As if it didn't matter. And I would be like, where is that? Oh, we left it there. We're not going back and get it. So I didn't realize what I realize now, all right? I should say thank you to them for leaving it there. Um, it wasn't something that I needed, okay? And it wasn't something that would actually benefit me in the direction that I'm going in my life, all right? So I was growing up really quick as a young child. So I now know that it was um, preparing me for what I'm doing now in my life. Now I've helped clients with every area of their lives, okay? So now I have to come in and look at your home space. We have looked at your energy. We have looked at your childhood. We have looked at your background, your blocks, you know, um, your subconscious mind, okay? Now we gotta hit your home space where you are marinating in, especially now. A lot of people um, hardly ever go out. They're afraid to go out, all right? So I know that. And now we can really hone in on your houseology and your body, all right? How are they connected, all right? How is your body connected in that home? There are, you know, areas in your house that represent you and all the family members. They represent the parts of the body, right? <laughs> they also represent the parts of our lives. There are so many things to learn. And I put a package together which has every bit of this, and it goes all the way to the end of this year, all right? Um, and I added some bonuses, some videos. I really dove deep into um, this program because I want everybody to start to be able to utilize this in their homes, all right? It has helped me and many of my clients. You will see... Um, you know, that there are people that were living in their car. For two weeks, they were out of there, right? One person, a couple days, they went into a place um, and they helped them to get on their feet, get a job. So once they started working, then they got an apartment. Then they had to move out of that apartment because they were making too much money. See, isn't that funny? Uh, making too much money, you got to move. All right, so see, these are things that happen. There was one lady, she couldn't sell her house. She was a real estate agent. And this was a million-dollar home. She went to do all kinds of help with everyone. She ended up finding me, and I work with her on the phone. I work with her through email, and... Um, gave her, you know, the correct things to do, and she did them. She was sending me photos of the work being done, and it wasn't even a week that Million Dollar Home sold, okay? Now, I'm not a real estate agent. She, you know, she is, all right? And I don't have to be a real estate agent. I am like a house whisperer, okay? Um, and I'm coming in to take a look and see what is, you know, out of balance, right? And like I said, it might not be clutter, right? It might be something else. 
but we want to dive in and find out what it is specifically. Because if we have worked, you know, on doing clearings over and over, and you still are stuck, all right, it may be a curse, okay? It may be some negative dark energies afflicting you, right? And it may be the home you are in, right, is not compatible with you. So we want to find that out, all right, and where the best place is for you and your family, all right. And you're going to learn all that in this brand new program as well. I can only cover so much on a call, um, you know, so I'll do my best to answer any questions you may have about your home and your area, all right? And if you have an issue in the area of finances, your health, your relationships, right? You just dial in, you press star to raise your hand. Um, if you are calling in on the webcast, you can just type in a question. I do like speaking one-on-one -on -one with people. It's a lot of fun. So I want to see how many of you um, are going to take advantage of this new program. It is here for you for your benefit, all right? I put it together because I know that you are ready to live your best life, right? Your dream life is waiting for you. It's just around the corner, all right? And even though there's COVID and there's fear and there's chaos, all right? And there's lost thoughts everywhere, all right? Fear of the future. If we get into center and we study, all right, during this time when we are in our homes, right? If we study something that is truly going to benefit our future, then we have nothing to fear because we are looking deep into it and you um, are the one who can really remedy it because you're there in that place right or you're ready to sell or you're ready to buy this will help you as well those of you about to build a home would really benefit from having this program because you would know exactly all right where to place things for you and your family members, all right? <clears throat> Which rooms go where, right? Which way um, should your house face for you? There's so many beautiful things to learn. So join me Thursday, all right, at 7 p.m., June 24th. And if you missed that call, there is a link going to be under here where you can click on and sign up on the Awakening Heart Network. You'll also get the email with the replay and some free MP3s. So um, there's a lot of different speakers that have offered these gifts. So I want you to take part in that and get something free as well. So also subscribe to this channel, all right? Share it with your family and friends. We have really um, high vibrational videos here, and I want you to partake in them. So if you're feeling sad, alone, you know, um, miserable, lost, you know, or even happy, you know, this channel can boost your vibration, change your thought patterns, lift your emotional state of being, right? We have so much fun here, and this is a beautiful, beautiful channel for you to come and visit every single day, all right? Come back, play a video over and over, all right? I'm adding to the channel. I just wanted to upload this info for you today and wish you much peace and joy. The word here is joy, all right? So receive joy right now, wherever you are, Whatever you are thinking right now, receive peace and receive joy about it because the best is yet to come. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.